we get a lot of young guys coming in, especially being as close to the base as we are. A lot of young military guys that are picking up their first bike. They're telling a lot of stories about all the great street rides that they go on, like out to Mount Rainier and stuff like that. And I always suggest that they come and do something like OPRT or another track school because you can learn so much. It's such a much safer environment. The capability of these motorcycles is absolutely incredible. It can really be overwhelming if you don't have the basic skills where you're not swept away by the performance of the motorcycle. It doesn't matter if you're young, if you're a middle-aged guy like me, when you get on one of these things, you're in the position and you're going to want to use it. These things can change your life in a second, but if you're properly trained and you're learning in a controlled environment such as this with classroom instruction and such, you can learn more in one day than you could learn in over a season of riding out by yourself on a back road somewhere. And the nice thing is, I don't know if you all know, in Washington State, 100 miles an hour, you're going to jail. No questions asked. Out here, you can find 100 all day long and have a big smile on your face. And when you leave, you got a clean driving record. You got a shiny bike that's not hurt and you have a body that's in one piece. And I think that's the most important thing when we go out. We want to have a good time. We want to come back with an undamaged bike and undamaged selves. And this is there you can do. It will save lives. There's no doubt in my mind. Once you learn the basic skills that you learn here, you're going to be a much better street rider much safer and as I said if you get it out of here anyway you're not going to feel the need to push it 10 tenths while you're out on the